Okay, Sagittarius, here's your angel number for the day. Could also be birth dates. Wow, you guys just had to do it today, didn't you? <laughs> you guys just had to do it. So we have 111222. So if you've been seeing like synchronicities like crazy, your spirit guides are with you, you're moving into a whole new um, chapter in life right now. It's like, matter of fact, I don't even feel like it's a chapter. I feel like it's a whole new damn book, Sagittarius. I feel like you've done thrown out an old book and you've just now transformed to another book. <laughs> like, um, but you have all new beginnings with the ones and then we have the twos. If you put all those twos together, it equals a sick, sick, some of you guys could be sick right now at home, but the twos equal a six, which is home. It's a home frequency. So a lot of you guys are going to be meeting like a soulmate who's going to feel like home to you. Okay. Um, I feel like you coming together with people. And if you add up every one of those one, two, one, two, one, twos, that's three, three, three. So you have three different sets of numbers here that you're dealing with, the ones, the twos, and the threes, okay? Which is the divine masculine, the divine feminine, and the divine child energy, okay? So you got all kinds of energy surrounding you here, Sagittarius, like um, a lot of new. Um, some of you guys could be getting pregnant too, uh, meeting the person this year and then having a child, meeting somebody. So be aware of that. Here's your card for the day. These cards are kind of big and they stick together <laughs> I don't use them often yeah unexpected okay so something unexpected is going to happen for you look at that that's a child <laughs> so there's like a need for you to stay in this childlike innocence okay that's how you're going to be able to manifest but also like like I said some of you guys could be meeting somebody this year and end up getting pregnant and end up having an unexpected child um, but something unexpected is coming towards you here okay so I think it's going to make you very happy. Look how happy that child looks. Okay. There's a fairy there too. So this may kind of be like, almost like, like whatever happens that is so good that you're going to be just kind of shocked by it. Like, wow, like I can't believe this is even happening. Okay. There's also a need for you to like get out into nature. Okay. So I'm drawn to those stairs though. Like where are those stairs going? <laughs> I feel like you're going up to like a higher frequency or something. It's just this card. And then that looks like a castle over there. Uh, it just almost seems really magical here, Sagittarius. You got a lot of good coming. Okay. Um, that 48 also breaks down to a three. So, because it's a 12, breaks down to a three. So this is childlike energy all over this card. Um, there's a need for you to stay childlike because I always tell you guys, if you want to attract abundance and, and manifest whatever it is you're manifesting, you have to stay in that innocence energy, okay? Because, you know, remember when you're a kid, I, I tell you all this, it's like you're not thinking about a boyfriend. You're just going outside to play or go be imaginary. Like, it's, just be that way. Don't worry about tomorrow. Don't worry about um, yesterday. Just worry about the day. Be childlike, okay? Um, be joyful. So have a good one.